Very simple, easy to use motor. Incredibly light, I think, without the, it doesn't have the battery in it now. Hey guys, I'm Jared with Striker Boats and we're up doing a little winter boating. So uh, we were hoping we were gonna get some snow this trip and sure enough, as we rolled in the driveway, we had snow. So what we have here today is we're gonna be running the brand new Merc 7.5E and we're gonna be pairing that with a 380 HD, a 2024. So this is gonna be, this is gonna be my first time running this motor. It's not a high performance motor. A lot of people say this is about the equivalent to a three to four horsepower. This is a very simple, easy to use motor. Incredibly light, I think without the, it doesn't have the battery in it now, which just makes for such an ease of use for storage, maneuverability, getting it around. The other great part about this motor is there's no fuel, there's no oil. So transporting it here, I just put it on the seat of my side by side. I wrapped it in a blanket and I never thought twice about it. There's no carburetor, so there's nothing to gum up. So for the boater who goes out occasionally that wants a very practical, easy to use motor, I think these are gonna be incredibly popular. There's no real downside to the electric other than you need to charge it. Now we've heard you have multiple hours of a full out run time on these. Now, if you're just trolling around, which the majority of people usually are, they say up to 19 hours of trolling time, which is more than your entire trip. So I think the benefits of these are gonna be are gonna be huge. Now, if you look down, look at the size of that prop. So you're gonna have a lot of torque and electric motors are always known for torque, but just looking at some of the things this motor has to offer, very cool. So there's uh, different functions. You can, you can uh, turn this handle, click it all the way down, and you can use it as a carrying handle, which is, which is very convenient. The motor's very light, and then you can just pop your battery in before you're going. You open up this guy, there's your battery slot, your fuse, um, and you simply just drop the battery in there. Batteries are interchangeable, so you can also swap that out easily. Come out for a little adventure with us, and, and we'll show you what some winter boating is all about. Now, winter boating has always been some of my favorite. I like to boat all year round, I don't feel like there's really a time where you can, especially where we live here in BC, you can basically boat all year round. So, um, without further ado, let's mount this thing up. So, I'm gonna do up the thumb screws. Now these motors do come in a variety of shaft lengths. So this is your standard 15 inch that we got on here today. There's also a 20 inch and there's also a 25. So sailboat applications, long shaft applications and short shaft, which is, is the majority of what you would, you would run in. We'll just tilt that back for our trip down to the water. snowy day it's cleared up for us 
you know, being out and being able to do things like this is, it's just absolutely incredible. I mean, most people are kind of hunkering down right now, but you know, having a, a, a boat package like this, it's so easy to use in the snow. It's a real treat. So right now this is a, this, we're running this new Merc Avatar 7.5 and this is my first run on it. And wow, what a treat. I mean, it's just, it's just absolutely incredible i'm i'm really enjoying the first few minutes i have so we're putting along right now so say let's check our normally i like to troll around three kilometers an hour right now we're going 2.6 kilometers an hour this is about how i would troll right now so we have about three quarters battery life left in there. And as you can see on our digital readout display, is right now we have 19.5 hours of battery life left. So I mean, essentially that's your entire trip or more available to you without having to recharge. Now, you know, for good measure and, and just because it, it's probably the right thing to do, I typically charge my stuff every evening. I may go for two days with something like this, but, uh, but this is great. Beautiful little motor. It's very intuitive. It's very easy to use. And, and the price is okay. Compared to some of these other electric brand motors out there, this is, this is a very nice little pack. The other thing that I really love about now, not just this motor in general, but all electric motors are how quiet they are. So this motor's running. You, you can't even hear the motor running right now. So when you're out and you're looking to have a peaceful getaway on the water, a little R&R, &R, having something like this, I mean, wh what a treat this is. So, um, you know what, Let, as with that, let's do a, a top speed. So there's three of us in the boat. So right now with three of us in a 12 and a half foot boat, we're doing 9.3 it kind of varies around between eight and a half and nine and a half so you know what o overall um I'm, I'm very impressed and and i really enjoy this little package right here guys and i know you're going to enjoy it too so check them out we do carry them in stock at striker this is a new 2024 mercury avatar 7.5